Okie dokie, I believe we are live and on the air. Um, I don't think we'll see any uh, of the group chat on this, but uh, anyway, uh, this is me versus uh, Swag Tud, no mercy. Um, so uh, yeah, uh, I suppose I'll hand the floor over to uh, uh, Swag Tud. Am I even pronouncing your name right? Yeah, it's Swagta. I used to go by Sweet GTA, ah. but people just kept pronouncing it that way. So I'm like, I'll adopt this. This is fine. <laughs> okay. All righty. So, um, well, uh, uh, go for it, man. All right. So first off, I just have a question regarding um, this whole statement you made uh, during your stream. You said that I've been nagging you for a debate for two years. Uh, whatever gave you that impression? Oh, God. You know, I... Here's the thing, and that might have been an error, um, because I have had people really want to debate me on things that either, you know, A, I have no interest in debating, or B, um, B um, I, don't, I don't think it'd be a, like a fair fight, you know? Mm -hmm. um, I, 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 pops, I, I possibly got you confused with somebody else. But I thought you did a while back wanted to do a debate with me on I believe it was gun control. I did. It was uh, gun control. I asked you back in July sixteenth, I believe. Oh, it, oh, I you know, uh, one of the things, and I think this is going to be a, a something that's going to pop up is you know I don't write scripts for for anything I do on YouTube, and you know I and. I tend to dial it up to 11 a little bit, so I, I might have just been rolling with it. That might have been an error. Um, again, I might have just gotten con you confused with someone else. Sure, that's fine. I was just kind of perplexed by it because it's like I asked you once like eight months ago. I don't think that's equivalent to two years. Yeah, I, I, like, I, like I said, I might have I, – I think I, the problem is I started to almost – the problem might have been I started to almost associate you and the autistic atheist as like almost one and the same people. So maybe I lumped you in with him. And I think he has been bugging me for a while for a debate. Actually, uh, I asked Mick, uh, Mick about this, Mick the autistic atheist. Um, and he stated that he only, the first time he actually asked you about a debate was uh, during his phone call. That, you know, the, the big phone call. Uh, that is yeah. no. That, you have to you. that is uh, that's absolutely not true. Um, what had happened was um, uh, we were going to do a debate, and then I was on his channel a little, and then he made his nine eleven video, which pissed me off. And I said, you know what? I'm not going to debate this person because all I'm going to do is end up yelling at him for the entire time. And I just said, you know what? I'm I'm not going to debate you. That's the end of it. Months go by, uh, maybe like four or five months, and I get the phone call from him. So no, uh, he no that thing of debate, and that was the first time he asked me. No, that's bullshit. Sure, he, but I mean, like, but I mean, like that that wasn't two years either. Um, I th I want to say I think he was pestering me for a while. Um, uh, I don't, I don't remember when I, when I had my first run in with him or what it was about. Um, but yeah, no, uh, his thing, that was the first time he asked me to debate was the phone call to my house. Mm -mm, no, I want to say that was at least a year. So maybe it wasn't a full two years, but I want to say that was at least a year because he was pestering me for a debate for a while. And then I said I'd do it, then the 9-11 video, and then, you know, nothing, and then calls my house, and here we are. Sure. Uh, th this was a thing I want to ask you about. When it comes to um, comedy, do you believe that comedy should have no limits? Um, uh, pretty much like with all things like that, um, I'd have to say yes. Um, you know, are there offensive jokes? Yes. Did I find his joke offensive? Yes. But rather than say autistic atheist must be removed from YouTube, he should not be allowed to be on this, this site. I just said, you know what? I don't want anything to do with you. I'm going to protest you by not acknowledging you. 
you know, you that did, is... You did acknowledge him, though, and you actually sent your audience to uh, attack his channel. <sighs> All I said in that video, and I remember it, I didn't send anybody anywhere. You actually All did. I said was, he did this, it's on his channel, go and watch it for yourself. What they do after that is is entirely up to them. It's the same thing as if your audience starts trolling my videos. Are you responsible for that? No. I don't think it's because... the same thing because I actually have a quote from you from that video. Um, you said, I'm gonna link, I'm gonna leave a link to their video in the description. I'm not seeing anybody do anything. But I'm just saying the information's there. If you want, you can click on their video, give it a thumbs up or thumbs down, give a supportive comment or not. I mean, that, that is obviously, you know, kind of trying to get your audience riled up to actually do something. All I would have had to do to get my audience riled up is just said, look what this guy did with 9-11. Most of my which audience is what, which are, is what are Americans. Did. But here's the thing. I said, do something or not. I just left the link in there. You know, sure, but I mean, but I mean, like, you're, you're not to them to do list. something. I didn't say go and bother the autistic atheist. No, you didn't see it verbatim, but it's like you know, well, again, insinuated again, that they should do something. Well, okay, should bearing should bearing be removed from YouTube because he leaves the original video in his description, and everybody accuses bearing of sending his fans over there. But he didn't like tell his audience give it a I said, comment or here's not. The link. I said, here is the link. Do with it what you want. You sure, know? but I mean, like, but I mean, like, you can tell from the tone in your video, you have like this very like dramatic uh, pause after you say, give it a supportive comment. You kind of rub your, I think you actually rub your hands together, like malignantly or whatever, like give it a supportive comment or not. You know, it's clearly d designed to actually get people to do something. Well, I, again, if if I would have just said the link to his videos in the description, you know, you would have you would have said the same thing. No, how do you know that? Uh, well, okay, I said in the video, here's this information. Do with it what you want. You know, leave it a supportive comment or not. You know, just because I said that doesn't isn't me saying go and do this. I don't command a friggin' army. I don't command, I, I have an audience, okay? I, I, what they do is entirely up to them. I'm not their dad. I'm not responsible for... No, I'm not saying you're responsible. I'm just saying, you know, that that's kind of inconsistent with what you just said. You actually, the, the way you phrased it gave the clear idea of like, you know, do this. Well, okay, you know? I, okay. Let's say, let's say, let's say, let's go on a limb. Let's say that I did say go and 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 uh, and uh, go to this guy's video. What's the worst that's going to happen? They're going to they're going to have mean comments. Oh God, no! That happens to me on damn near a weekly basis, where the feminist Reddit picks up my video game and I'm flooded with comments. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure, I get that. I mean, like I've like you know, I, I get a fair amount of use, and as such, I get a fair amount of like you know detractors and all that. I, that's fine. I'm just saying that you know, like at least be honest about it. You didn't just put it in there just for like, oh, you know, here's here's this thing I'm uh, referencing in my video. You clearly gave the idea of like you know, give a supportive comment, dot 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 or not, you know. Yeah. Okay. If you want to interpret it that way, then then that's on you. Yeah. I mean, like, how, how else would I interpret it? It's it's clearly not neutral. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's say I did that for that one video. Uh, have I said anything else about any of the other videos he's made? No. I made one, one exception. Yeah. Which led to uh to to me basically never wanting to mention him again. I've probably but spent more time on him today than I have in the past six months no you actually made like uh three videos on him when did i do that uh the initial video you made was uh, i think it's titled war corpse versus the autistic atheist uh the second video where you didn't mention him, him by name but it's a video about him uh which is i may have been doxxed uh the third video was uh i think it's called you had one fucking thing yeah though and th that after that i didn't mention him 
Yeah, but I mean, like, I was, you, you, I was you, going you, to basically, you, I was going to leave him off the hook. All he had to do was just leave, and then I wouldn't have mentioned his name. That's not what I'm talking and about, though. His story, oh, and, and by the way, his story on that has changed, like, quite a bit. Sure. You can I mean, see like, I'm, I'm not here opinion. to. I'm not. I'm not here to make excuses for excuses for misbehavior. Like I stated in in my video that you requested, I made, which you apparently did watch. Uh, I I condemn his actions and I disapprove of them. Um, as far as you know, you just stated that uh, this is the most time I've spent, you know, on this person. Ever since like this whole thing began. No, that's not true. You've made three videos. <laughs> And how many videos on other subjects did I make in between? Uh, uh, about 400? Qu quite a few, but your statement is still false. The, the amount of videos you've made on other topics is not pertinent to that at all. Yeah. Okay. I made, you said yourself, the last time I mentioned him was you had one fucking thing. Okay? No. I made that... Hold on, let me see if I can pull it up when I made that because I didn't mention him after that. You actually, so you're talking about a month, months and months of of gap in between. Sure, but I mean, like the statement that this is the most time I've spent on him. You know, this is no. You made three videos <laughs> months ago. Yeah, sure. I mean, you could you could make this argument about Anita Sarkeesian. But not him, not when there's months and months worth of gap in between. So, sure. I mean, again, if I kept bringing him up and I kept and I kept watching his shit or commenting on his shit, you'd have a point. But I said, you know, this, yes, I made three videos on him. And then that stopped up until my live stream about a week ago. Yeah, I just wanted to correct that because you were like, I didn't do that. Then I pointed it out. I named those videos. Whatever. Let's let's just move forward. Uh, whatever. Um, but but I mean, like, it's still, you, you say that you confused us as as one single person. I, I mean, well, like we have kind of different names and and personalities. You know, like us being friends. I don't I don't see how that would ever give you the idea that we're the same person. Uh, again. This is a time where maybe I was in error, where I was on a roll, dialed that, dialed the intensity up to 11, and just went with it. I mean, what are you looking for here? I'm looking for consistency. Again, I, okay, I made a mistake. Uh, like, what do you want? Um, Again. That was it. I just, I just needed you to say, just like I was wrong. That's it. That's sufficient for me. Okay. Uh, just out of curiosity, why did you assume so many things about me? Like, like I know you retracted your statements, but you never clarified why you thought I uh, half doxed you, or why I was fine with Mick calling you. You never really clarified why you got that impression. Um. Again, it was. Again, it was in in the heat of the damn thing because again i'm not the biggest fan of him popping up on my damn live streams um you know again it might have just been something i said um <laughs> again i said i'd make a retraction video if you like i made a retraction in my in the live stream i just got done doing and said not, you had nothing to not, do with not, it. Not, uh, you didn't retract everything. You didn't retract the whole uh, two-year statement thing. I mean, like, the, the things you... The way you describe people actually has influence on how people view said people. You know, if, if I describe you as, like, this... Uh, for example, if, if I were to describe you as, as this uh, lunatic, for example, you know, on, on my channel, do you not think some people would get that impression? Um, to be quite honest, I could care less. To, be, right. to be brutally honest. I, I just I, beg to differ. I, I kind of care about how, how people uh, portray me, especially when it comes to my public figure. <laughs> to, to be brutally honest, why? This is, it, it, look, look, this is YouTube, okay? This is not real life. I'm not, I'm not 
slandering you, the guy, if you want to call this slander. I, I, would, um, go, I, I would go as far as to say it, uh, that it initially was slander until you retracted it. So it's still like kind of a serious matter. Okay, but here's the here's the thing. You can't. Okay, the way I am on YouTube. Okay. And I'm sure this applies to you too, and applies to most YouTubers, is the people we are when we click on, we're not those people in real life, okay? I'm not War Corpse when I'm doing my daily thing, you know? So, you know, you saying um, how this affects your, your character, well, it, it's, it's just YouTube. It is not, it shouldn't affect a damn thing. Sure, but I mean, like, I have friends and family who, who watch me and follow what I do, and if somebody were to say, you know, like, oh, this guy committed this crime, because that's, that's essentially what you said. You said, and I, as I stated, you retracted this, thankfully. No, I, and I, I, I said it was half-doxing, half-ass doxing. All right, well, let's, let's dive into that. If, how does one half-dox someone? Half-doxing is they do something like, let's say, call the house, like this person did, but they don't release the info. But it's still rather creepy. I mean, I had to change my fucking number because of it. So sure, I've had I've had that happen to me uh, at one point back in like 2014. So I mean, like I can understand the frustration, but it, I mean, I don't really see how how you can half commit a crime. Well, I don't think doxing really is a crime. I mean, it, I, it, it is. might be. It is, it is against the law. But, again, how rigorously is it? It's one of those things of how rigorously is it actually investigated and enforced? Well, it depends on the context of the case. Well, yeah, but, I mean, how? how again, they couldn't do anything to him anyway because he's Eastern European. And then Interpol ain't going to get involved. Sure, you know, but but I mean, it's it's still kind of like a big deal, isn't it? To, well, again, it's well, okay. Let's just say it's let's just say what he did wasn't elite. It, it's it's kind of like with Anita Sarkeesian. I'm always careful to say she's conning, but she's doing it legally. What he did. Well, creepy, there's no criminality to it. Sure. But, you um, know, um, as for, you know, your thing with, with um, you know, your, your YouTube persona or whatever, it, honestly, you know, it's, it's like this, this debate. If, if the fans that are watching it now of mine and yours, if they say I lose then fine, but it'll be most likely forgotten about in about a week at best. You know, that that's the thing. I mean so I, I don't I don't get But I mean like why, why even have any debate then with like any any kind of uh minor public figure on this website? Why give them the time of day if it's gonna become irrelevant eventually anyway? Well First part for me is I enjoy talking to people, especially people that um, I disagree with. Um, and I do think debate is is getting to be a. I, I don't know what country you're you're from. I'm assuming from your accent you're an American. Uh, I'm Swedish, um, actually. Really? Oh, well, your English is very good. Thank you. Um, but I think debate, at least in America is becoming a a lost thing and we're and actually pretty much in the west it's becoming a lost thing where nobody wants to hear another viewpoint and and again like i've admitted that i was wrong like four times in this already that's another thing that's becoming a lost thing you know um nobody wants to admit that might have fucked that up you know um so that's why I that's why I enjoy it, um, it, it uh, at least on my end, because uh, I enjoy talking to people. Uh, again, especially people that um, I might disagree with a little bit. Um, but 
Well, okay, I'll tell you what. For I say now for all to hear, Swagda <laughs> had nothing to do with it. It has not been two goddamn years. Apparently, I was on a roll, and I rolled into a pile of shit, and the shitball kept getting bigger. Apparently, I did not only stick my foot in my mouth, I decided to eat the whole goddamn leg. So. All right, that, that'll suffice. Because, <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, like, um, uh, there is one thing I do got to ask you since you're, since you're Swedish. All right, go ahead. No, I'm not right, a feminist. I, well, you're a gamer, so you're already on their shit list. <laughs> um, I read an article from Sweden where there was a group of Swedish feminists that were trying to make it illegal to criticize feminism. Was that actually true or was that just... Uh, dude, I don't know what is real or fiction in Sweden at this point. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> So, um, honestly, I've, I've disconnected myself from like most mainstream politics and news because I like I I don't really I don't feel like the the uh, constant worrying about how the society is gonna go like I don't I don't feel like that's gonna do me any good at this point I'd rather focus on like you know <laughs> what's Trump up to to me that's more fun. Um, right now, uh, at the moment, I hate to say it because I've been a I've been a well, I've been a defender of him because he's only been in office for two weeks. So I'm like, you give the guy a chance. But right now he's doing a great job of somewhat making an ass of himself. I mean, his his I, I'm not kidding. His press secretary told the press that um Oh yeah, the, alternate the stores, facts. I saw that. <laughs> yeah, that the stores that dumped his daughter's clothing line, that's an attack on the president. No, it's not. It's a it's a private business not wanting to carry a bunch of shit that nobody wants to fucking buy. It, it's uh, it's uh, I, I, I again getting back to getting back to what I what I said earlier. That's a symptom of why Trump was elected. Yeah, uh, getting back to the topic at hand, um, oh, I just yeah. I, I just remembered uh, one of the things that I think. Uh, it's it's not important, but I, I feel like pointing it out. Um, during the stream that you had, or we had our back and forth uh, via the chat, uh, yes. I, sta I stated that um, you sent your fans to uh, attack my friend Mick, and uh, what happened was that you said, Swagtel, I'll get back to you. Um, and then some time passed, my comment faded because, you know, there's comments constantly piling up and, you know, covered mine. Uh, and you responded with, no, Swagta, I never sent my fans to attack you. I just wanted to clarify that I never made that statement. I, I said that you attack that you sent your fans to attack my friend Mick, not me. Just felt I think I should clarify that. Uh, okay, I I honestly I I don't I don't remember it, and honestly, even if I even if I did send my fans over to you, you have three times the subscribers I do. So it would be kind of a mute point. Um, I, like I said, I didn't send anyone anywhere. I just said, uh, here's the information. You can, it, that comes down to damn near a matter of opinion. Again, so, I, I, I tend to get irritated when people are, when people try to hold YouTubers responsible for the actions of anyone that listens to them. Yeah, that is They're, not what I'm trying to do. I'm, I'm just saying that, like, I, I think that your intent with uh, um, telling people to either give Mix uh, video a supportive comment or not, I think that the intent there was to actually get people to give him uh, rude comments. Okay, and, and let me well, let me let me also clarify this. Um, now, you're Swedish. I'm an American. Um, Mick is Eastern European. He's also okay. Swedish. The fuck can you be? Isn't Swedish Eastern Europe? Uh, whatever. No, it's Northern Europe. But go ahead. Um, that is, believe it or not, the only time I did that, and it was because of nine eleven, which is a huge, huge open wound for America. Still, uh, sixteen years later. He, that is the only time I've ever done anything like that. And it was be, and it was in response to an extreme example. You know? 
I sure, mean, but, it was, again, but it wasn't relevant to the arguments he made. You know, you might take issue he, with that, the, but the, if, if the you're going to make a res the the video that I seen at least was just him watching television, laughing when the plane crashed into the that World was not him. That, that was him taking um, a, a sample from a live stream and and editing it to make to make it look to make it appear as if the people in the video were laughing at 9/11 taking place when. They were probably laughing at something else. And that's uh, the and that's the video that I sent everyone to. Or as you say, I insinuated that they might want to go over there and check it out. Why in the hell would you do that if not to piss people off in America? You know, um, I'm not saying we're the focal point of the world, but again, you're gonna you're gonna irritate and here's the thing. I have no problem with with his right to do it. I didn't say that YouTube should kick his ass off. I just, you know, I just said, well, I'm done with you. Here's I'm just this video. I'm just pointing out that it's irrelevant to his arguments and that I've actually spoken to Mick about it. You, you said that you don't really see uh, why he would make that video. I've t spoken to him about it. He says that uh, the absurdity of somebody finding 9-11 so funny is, is what made that funny. Well, uh, speaking as an American, the joke did not work on me. Sure, that's understandable, but, it's not, it. but it's still, it's not relevant to his actual arguments. Yeah, it is. How? Why um, is that? Well, you said the joke is... How did you put it again? Uh, the, the joke of the... like What made it funny for him and the reason why he made it is because somebody having that kind of reaction to a tragic event is so absurd you know absurdity and exaggerations are a vital element of comedy you know as carlin said um most jokes need some kind of something to be far out of proportion for it to be funny that is oh, what okay. is so out of proportion the fact that somebody would have that reaction to a tragic event okay uh then let me tell you from an american standpoint watching that video I don't speak for every American, but I'm going to speak for, I think, a decent majority of them. We wouldn't, we wouldn't see that. We take that very, very literally, as I took it, okay? I didn't see context. I didn't see nuance. I didn't see any of that. All I seen was some jackass laughing at the worst day in, and again, it, it, it also depends on um on the subject you 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 put on if it was i don't know maybe like princess diana's death it might have worked it, the, the the point might have been made but in this instance no any point that he was trying to make died on the vine because he made All a I joke seen that you didn't was like that you know um go go ahead because he made a joke that you found to be in bad taste. No, it, it's because there wasn't a joke there. Any joke you, or any I mean, like, point died you, on the vine. Okay, let, let me let me ask you a question. If if I if I did the same video with the Holocaust, you'd have a different reaction. Or if I did the um, did the same thing with the uh muslim migrants that are fucking shit up you'd have a different reaction how do you know that i've i've myself in, have engaged in like jokes about the migrant situation myself because that's how you cope with tragic events you know for example uh, the people back in like the 80s when the whole aids epidemic was uh you know in the news p comedians would joke more more about aids than anything else because that's how people cope with it it might, it might have been it might have been rude for him to do that, but at the same time, you know, for you to say that there is no joke there, I mean, like there is, it's it's completely subjective. You found it to be in bad taste. He did not. That's the end of it. Okay, then, uh, as some feminists would say, I've got the right to get pissed off with it. Um, I'm sorry, can you repeat that? The other, th the other thing is, again, any joke, um, and look, most of my audience is mostly American, and they agreed with me. And my audience doesn't just blindly agree with me. Lord knows I've pissed them off more than once. But a lot of people had the same viewpoint as me. Where it's just like, what the fuck is your fucking problem?
But how, do, how does that matter? Isn't that like an appeal to popularity then? You know, people agree with me, so I'm right. No, I mean, like, there's people who agree with Hitler. It doesn't matter. Again, the joke was lost. You know, I, I'm sorry, but, you know, yes, he can make it. Yes, he can say it. And yes, it might be funny. But the vast majority of people didn't find it funny. The vast majority of people were kind of pissed off with it. You know? And? Well, I, I don't know what more you want. I mean... But I mean, like, how's that pertinent to his arguments, is what I'm asking. Okay, his arguments are shit, then. <laughs> then explain the, the why. The arguments are shit because the joke was fucking shit. It wasn't fucking funny. It didn't make a point. All I seen was some fat fucking asshole laughing at the worst day in American history. Again. But but, but that's a separate video. His, his arguments were featured in a different video. That video has since been taken down. I don't know why he did well, that, but... Then maybe if you're going to do that, not have two separate videos and have your argument coming right after. You know, I don't know if that's just shitty YouTubemanship, but again, I only seen the standalone fucking video. I'm not going to dig through and try to find the companion video. If he they were two separate to videos. Do that, then he should have made one fucking video, and then I probably wouldn't have said shit. One video was about the arguments you made, and he made his response. The other was completely irrelevant. He, I, I don't even know if he sent you that video, did he? The 9-11 uh, one? No, yeah. I was actually on his channel. I think I had watched his... So you picked that uh, manually from the channel and featured it on your channel in the beginning of your video. I didn't feature it. I didn't you show it. You did. No, I didn't. If I'd have featured it, I would have shown the motherfucker. I would have you, done you a voiceover over thing. I would have shown it. I didn't even show it. I just said, there's the link in the description. Do with that what you fucking want. Okay? All I seen was a probably 30 second video of him la and i think it actually came up in my suggested video feed so you know what am i supposed to do with this as an american wait again, hold on hold on hold on hold on wait i just i just want to clarify youtube actually recommended a 911 joke video uh, believe it or not if you're on somebody's channel like if i'm on your channel your videos will be pretty much the first i don't know 10 or so, your videos will dominate the suggested videos page. I don't know how random it is, but that's one of the ones that came up. Um, All right, sure, that makes sense. Uh, but again, let's say the same thing happens in Sweden to, um, uh, to, to, to somewhere. Terrible tragedy, and then I make a joke about it. You'd be pissed off. Even if I make a companion, and I don't add the companion video to it i don't give it any proper context all you see is me making fun of uh sweden uh getting attacked you'd have the same fucking reaction i found the video in question it, it appears to be gone from your channel but i have it on my hard drive backed up uh if if google hangouts has screen sharing i'd probably show it uh what the video i made that yeah, video should still be up. It's it's titled War Corp Six 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 versus the Autistic Atheist. The Autistic Atheist is uh, without spaces. No, oh, um, like I said, that video should be up. So, all right, well, go check that the, out. The video in question actually does feature that clip from uh, the joke Mick made, and and it cuts to you glaring into your camera for a moment before uh, beginning your rant. So you did feature it. I don't know. I haven't watched that video for probably. Uh, since it's been made, so I'll have to go back and check. Sure, but I mean, like, maybe you should have watched that prior to being like, no, that wasn't featured. J Jesus Christ, I've made almost 3,000 videos or more. Do you honestly think I can remember every single one of them? No, but I mean, like, if you're, if you're gonna talk, if you're gonna, if you're gonna deny something being in the video, maybe, like, actually know what the video contains. <laughs> What do you just want me to admit when I fuck something up, some minor thing up? Uh, Again, no. I've made I, I want you to. I want videos, you. And I want you to actually uh, like. All right, go ahead. I made over three thousand videos. This video was made months ago. 
for Christ's sakes, bar, but at my age, you tend to have a hard time remembering four days ago because you have these things called bills and jobs and all this other shit rolling around. So, yeah, I so, don't... So wait, so I, I might have edited it. So, I mean, like, you're wrong. That's it. You were just wrong. It's fine to be wrong. Is is this the whole point? You just getting me to admit that I'm wrong? Fine, I was wrong. I mean, like, it's like, not the main like, point. I'm just, I'm just saying this that is if not, we... This is not the first time I've had to admit that I've been wrong, but this is getting to be kind of over minor shit. How is it minor yeah. shit? It's something relevant to the discussion at hand. First off, I, you're, 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 you're making the... I don't even know what the discussion's about. All we're doing it's is about your, over, it's I about, forgot this, I forgot that, I forgot this. You know, again, okay, I forgot that I that I put the video in there. Oh God, does it change the fact that the majority of Americans, if they see that, are going to get pissed off? No, I just corrected Answer what you no. said. I just corrected what you said, that's it. You said that clip is not featured in the video. I wouldn't feature it. And then I I actually have it on my hard drive. I could be uploaded or send it to you if you want. I'm it's actually probably with me. It's probably still up on my channel. All right. Um if I did, then oh god, I made the video months ago, if not a year ago. I had completely forgotten about it. Um again, but it doesn't alter my point. What is your point? With that particular video, here we have somebody making fun of 9-11, no context, no anything. So, yeah, I got a little pissed off. And? That's it. Okay, so you're pissed off. How, how does that affect any of his arguments? You stated that uh, his arguments were shit. He didn't make any arguments the in the fucking video. All he did, this is the video. Him and his friends on the couch. It's not him in the video. Yeah, it is. No, it's, it's a well-known streamer. Okay, here's the video in question. They're on the couch. They watch the shit. They watch the planes fly in. They laugh. That's all I've seen. Okay? Like, right. that's the fucking video. No context, no anything. If he would have said, now before you get all pissed off with me, here's the point... Again, probably shouldn't have been a separate video. I only seen the preamble. Okay? There wasn't... It was... Again, I think I even may have played that damn video verbatim. If I did do that. Because one of the things I am known for is not taking people out of context. Not using clips. And playing videos verbatim. That's why any commentary track I do is 20 fucking minutes long. You know, again, uh, let me see if I can find the video. All right. Uh, All right. Mick is telling me on Steam that it was indeed a separate video. Oh, God damn it. All right. Uh, test tick atheist. I guess I'll just amuse the audience by responding to some comments in the chat in the meantime, so we don't have dead air. All right, go for it. All right. Um, let's see. Apparently, Mick is actually in your chat. <laughs> why? Like, if if you have such a problem with him being in your chat, why not just block him? Um. Here's here's the reason why. Again, it comes down to a simple fact. I have a rule. I don't block. Why is that? And sometimes, I, and sometimes, as much as it irritates me, I uh, I follow that rule goddamn near to a fault. But it seems like, you know, it's not really doing you much good in this case. I, again, you know... Again, it's I follow the rule to a fault almost. Um, 
It's not really doing me any harm. All right, well, at least you're consistent. Uh, I'm just, I'm just saying, like, you know, like, uh, initially, I, I kind of had the same idea of, like, I'm not going to block people. I'm going to let them say whatever they want. In case, like, even if they tell me, like, I fucked your mom, Swekta, you know, but it gets to the point where it's like, okay, there's people who constantly send me stupid shit, and, you know, at some point, you realize that you're going to have to block people if, if you want to maintain your sanity. In this case, it's obviously, you know, pissing you off. Okay, I have the video. Okay, I. Yeah, it's it's a fifth. It's a one minute and thirty five. Thirty five uh... second video, and again, it's just them laughing at it. Yeah, and it has nothing to do with his arguments. It's just hosted on the same channel. That's it. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe you should have had you know some context with it. Um... What? It's on his channel. He published it. Um, yeah, but it wasn't in like response to anything you had said. It was just list. on the channel. Well, again, if I, if I put um, a, a video, like a pro-Nazi video on my channel, I could uh, that argument doesn't work. Okay, so hold on. If 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 so, okay. So you were talking about uh, why rapists rape. That was the discussion between you and Mick. Uh, if you were to put up a Nazi video on your channel, how would that be relevant to the topic of rape? It, it's not. It's it's no, irrelevant. No, my, my point is is that I I put up a Nazi video, people get pissed off. Okay. Yeah, and and he puts up a nine eleven video where it seems. Let's just assume that it's. Let's just assume that it's even even fake. Um, or it seems <laughs> oh my where... god! Yeah, wait, wait, wait! Hold on! I just I'm sorry. I got to interject. Do you actually think that's Mick in the video? I don't. I've never fucking seen him. I mean, like, but there's even videos. If it's oh, not, oh, even oh, if it's fucking not, even if I put a, a, a video by a, a YouTube a YouTuber I like, and he does this pro Nazi thing again. Here's the fucking video. It makes it seem like they're watching the 9-11 things. They laugh. Yeah, the end. I Nothing to, to do story. with this actual every, arguments. Every argument is irrelevant. I'm not talking about his entire argument. I'm talking about the one video he published and I got a hold of. Okay? That's where the argument begins and that's where it fucking ends. You know, again, it... it, it you don't do video responses a whole lot, do you? Uh, no, not really, unless I okay. find something really preposterous that I want to respond to. Okay, here's how you do a video response. The video <laughs> is the sole argument. That is the entire argument. Not the four videos before it, not the four videos after it. That yeah, so why, video... so, why, so why not respond to his video response then? Why respond to his 9-11 video? Again, I'm an American, and I seen somebody laughing at 9/11. I would have done the same thing. That's all the explanation that's needed. You're an American. That's it. No, I'm an American responding to somebody laughing at 9/11. But instead of giving him the time of day when it comes to that video, why not respond to his actual arguments? Because there was no arguments in the video. It was just them laughing. Yeah, because it's a separate video. He actually uploaded a response video oh, to your God. video. Again! This is how you do a re video response. The video itself is the beginning and the end of the argument. That is it. There's no... There's no fucking before video. There's no after video. I don't review. I don't... You know, that video is the, is the argument in and of itself done. The video I mean, like, is let, separate. Let me give you an example. Um, all right, so, so when it comes to drug usage, I, I have a relative that I care a lot for who has been in drug use use and almost died on several occasions. That is something that I care you know a lot for and something that is very like you know hits home. Uh, if, let's say like Onision makes a video uh, again on like veganism. Do you think it would make sense for me to go to his channel and pick out a comedy video poking fun at drug addictions and respond to that rather than to respond to his actual veganism video? Because that's essentially what you did. 
Just replace no. veganism with with the, the topic of rape. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. It's it's a completely no, separate you, video. You, you, okay, you said, would it make sense to go to an Onision video, talk about drug addiction, when Onision in the video is talking about veganism? Okay. No, I'm, I'm, yeah, sure. Okay. That doesn't that that wouldn't work because you're talking about two separate things. Exactly, he and that's what you're doing. You're you're picking out a video that is completely irrelevant to his response video. Well, then maybe he should have combined the videos that might have put it into context with the ones that were relevant. Why should he have How done that? How many times do I gotta beat this fucking dead horse? Videos when you respond to them are the beginning and the end of the argument. There is no multi-part bullshit. Okay, or label then, it part one or two. Maybe then you might have a choice. But he didn't. He just left it separate, as is. Yeah, and rightfully Again. so. Because because let me let me just clarify. The video he made in response to you was titled War Corp 666 versus the autistic the autistic I atheist part one. I and I can I can I, I can send that video to you and to the people watching. Uh, it's a separate video from the video you picked out. You sh what you should have responded to should have been the uh, War Corp 666 versus the Autistic Atheist, not the 9-11 joke video. That's that's irrelevant. You know, you know what? If I I might have been actually responding to that and then seeing that, and then it was like fuck it and fuck him. <laughs> fuck it and fuck him. So just don't address Basically, any arguments. Yeah. Just 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 pick out this one sensitive subject matter. Because it's easier. Uh, I, I don't know. You know, uh, we could do a poll with American YouTubers. 9 11, a little, little sensitive. Look, look, I'm not denying that 9 11 is a sensitive subject. Video, hold on, hold on. I'm not denying. Just give me one moment, please. I'm not denying right. that it's a sensitive subject matter. I understand that. I'm just saying it's irrelevant to his arguments. If you want to take offense to that and just address it in your video and say, I think this is in poor taste, you should be ashamed for doing that, that's fine. But don't represent that as like his sole response to you. That wasn't even in response to you. That was a separate video. The video response he made was titled War Corp 666 versus the Autistic Atheist Part 1. That is his video response. It's on his channel. I can send that to you. That is the video you should have responded to. Because that's the well, video that actually contains his arguments. Here's a, here's another way to look at it. I seen the 9-11 video. I responded to that. And I believe in that video. I said, I want nothing more to do with you. I'm not going to respond to you. I'm not going to um, respond to your arguments. We're not going to have a fucking debate. I'm not going to bring you up. So there it is. End of fucking story. Any, any, any time I would have given him died when he made that video. I'm not just going to, again, it'd be like if I'm supposed to debate someone on capitalism versus communism, but it comes out that they're making, um, again, like a pro-Nazi video. I'm not going to debate you. No, fuck you. Bye. Because, because, because they hold political views you disagree with? <laughs> uh, well, it depends on the political views, but yeah. <laughs> then why respond to feminists? Uh, I don't know. It, uh, again, it's easy. It makes me money. Um, so shooting fish for? in a barrel, that's it? You don't actually have any ideas or you don't want to learn anything? You don't want to have any kind of discussion and, and convey some kind of point? You, if I you didn't just think want to it's have easy? why the fuck am I talking to you? But I mean, like, there's no, like, political thing that separates us. Aside from the fact that you're a libertarian and I'm not. That's about it. I'm not a libertarian. I, th I think you actually stated in a past video that you were. I've said the closest thing you could get me on is libertarian, but I'm not. All right, fair, all right, fair enough. My bad. Um, uh, what do you mean, like, do you not realize how preposterous it sounds that, that you say that I do it because it's easy and money? Like, is, is that, isn't that what you, you said? Well, okay. I, I've checked out your channel. You have a lot of bully videos. Why do you keep playing the same game? Because it's fun, and I like the community. Exactly. Picking on feminists is fun. No, you like stated that it's... It, and okay, again, so it, it's, it's kind of easy with them because all their arguments are the same. But, but when I asked you why do, why do that when it comes to... Okay, so, so you said you wouldn't respond to a Nazi because it, you differ politically. That's what you said. 
Yes. I Well, would I respond to them? Responding in a video format is a little different. Um, um, responding to a video is a little different than having a live debate. Um, but look, and again, all this changed when he called my house. Again, we're talking about two separate things here. Anytime, when he did that, that was definitely the end. Any chance he would have had to get me into a debate. Also, I don't know if he is or he is not autistic. But if he is, he wouldn't have a chance against me anyway. Why is that? Do you think autistic people are stupid or something? He doesn't have a, have a chance. No, like, why is sli being slightly on the spectrum, uh, why does that make you incapable of forming cogent arguments? What do you think that is? Or being on the, uh, uh, okay, again, I don't know how autistic he is. I don't even know if he is. He, but, he is, again, but, but I mean, a, like. It wouldn't be a fair fight. It, but the thing is, you've had back and forth with him prior to this take to this taking place. Yeah, like, like his then name the was the autistic happened, atheist. I, Sorry, then the video ahead. happened, and I said, you know, that's it, we're done. Then he called my house, and I even said, just go away. I won't reveal who you are, and he couldn't do that. He just had to apologize, which again. Didn't want you to apologize, just wanted you to leave. And, and um, when you say you, you mean the autistic atheist. The autistic atheist. Um, All right, uh, let, let's get back to the, uh, the, the point you were making. Uh, do, do you honestly think that him being autistic would be an obstacle in him debating you? Uh, I, okay, I'll, I'll fully admit I am not a doctor, but um, I gotta go, I don't know, probably. Really? But again, if I beat him, um, you know, and I don't remember what the hell we were going to debate anyway. And I think it was gun control. Somebody wanted to debate me on gun control, either you or him or both of you. That, that was me. He wanted to debate you on the topic of why rapists rape. I thought he wanted to debate me on capitalism versus communism. I have but, no idea, but I know that, again, was the, that, was the, that was the actual uh, topic that ended up uh, causing this... Uh, uh, animosity, animosity between you and him. To me, there is no animosity. He can do his thing. Again, even with what he did, I didn't ask for his removal from YouTube. I didn't tell YouTube shit. I didn't flag. You, you, you actually videos. told him. You actually told him to sh shut down his channel at one point. Oh, geez, I said something in a video. That's a legally binding thing. I didn't report him to anyone. I'm not saying it's legally binding. I'm saying it's inconsistent with your statement. You know, you're 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 looking for inconsistent. Okay, you just spent thirty minutes yapping about how I uh, cherry picked and narrowed in on this one little part, and I should have seen this broader videos thing with five fucking parts that weren't labeled. And I don't actually do anything that could do any anything real to his channel. I just mentioned shut down your channel. If I did at all, I'll just assume that I did. Um, and then you're 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 nitpicking again. It's you're not being very consistent with your arguments. Why is that? It okay? It's like again, if I do it, it's cherry picking. If he does it, it's just fine. I, I, again. When did he I do, do that? Anything. I didn't. I didn't report him to YouTube. I didn't report him to anybody. Actually, you know, all I said was just fucking leave. Bye. You know. Uh, again, no real actual. Uh, uh whatevers. But um, yeah. I, again, and you you just spent thirty minutes harping on the fact that he had videos explaining the context of the 9-11 video. No, I, I, that's not what I said at all. What I said was he has a video that is in response to your video, and in, rather than responding to his video, you responded to his joke that was completely completely irrelevant to the topic at hand. Again, um... That is my issue. 
okay, then I didn't take it as completely irrelevant. And I decided at that point that um, I wasn't going to debate him or have anything more to do with him. He should have just been a fucking adult and accepted that fact and then, you know, pissed off and did whatever in the fuck he does. That was the end of it. But he decided to keep it going. And then he took it to a creepy level. Yeah, and as I've stated, I condemn that. You know, fine. But, again, any any argument he made, and I'm kind of thinking back now, I think I actually did have a video in the can ready to go that was a response to his arguments, and then I decided, you know what, fuck it, no, I'm not doing that with this asshole. But you realize how that kind of comes back to bite you in the ass now, don't you? Uh, no, it really doesn't. Um, so, I so, you know, so what you're this. saying is, so what you're saying is, I had a video in response, but I decided to upload this other thing that is completely irrelevant to his arguments because he made a joke and a like. <laughs> he made a, a video in very poor taste to a event that about oh, I don't know, twenty three hundred families, if not more. Uh, are probably still really sensitive about. Um, yeah, I made a video about that and decided that was the end of it. I'm done with this asshole. Okay? I didn't care what he had to say. If you want, if you want it in plain English, I didn't care about his arguments. I didn't give a shit. When he did that, that was it. You know, I mean, how, how, how much more plainer do you want me to say it? Didn't I'm care. sorry, you cut out. Didn't care. You don't care? No. I, I When he made the 9-11 thing, I didn't care what he had to say to me. I didn't care about our debate. I didn't care about our feud. When you did that, there's, you know, again, 2,700 American families that lost loved ones, and you're going to fucking laugh about it. Fuck you. Don't give a shit. Don't give a shit what you have to say. Don't care about your arguments. Don't want to hear from you. Go fuck yourself. Live a happy life and piss off. If you don't care about his arguments, then why did you make arguments in your own video in response to the arguments he had made in the comment section? Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, because before the 9-11 video, I was considering debating him. Then that video happened. And then... Yeah, that's, that's where it's end. And, and any response I might have given to him set post this is just why are you here piss off and leave i've told you leave now again i carry the no block thing to a damn near fault but again before 9 11 the 9 11 video i was considering debating him after that that died I, it seems like you say again a lot and you tend to kind of switch topics we keep going over the same ground. Because so it's still again relevant. Is the, again, is the rather, rather, rather appropriate word. You know, you're you're circling back to this thing of of my 9/11 video having no relevance to the video he made to me. The video he made to me is irrelevant at that point to me. Anything he had to say to me is null and void. Fucked and done. He made that 9-11 video. What do you mean, like, why I didn't is give that? a is shit it... what he had to say. He could have fucking had the cure for cancer in his video and I wouldn't have given a fuck. <laughs> that's that's kind of a... Again, you ask a lot of Americans, they'll give you the same response as me. Uh, so, so rather than just swallowing your pride, if he actually... I don't know why I'm going over this. If he actually did have the cure for cancer, you would be like, I, I'd neglect that because he made a joke I don't like. Well, first off, if he was that smart, he wouldn't have made the joke in the first place. But, uh, again, no, I probably wouldn't care. The world might, and the cure would probably get out. But I would be the one guy that would always say, yeah, before you give him the Nobel Prize for medicine, remember this motherfucker... Uh, made light of the wor one of the the worst day in the 21st century for America. Right. 
All right, so, so so you just have like you know moral qualms with it is is what you're saying. Um. Yeah, but again, um, I didn't ask for the video to be removed from YouTube. I didn't flag the video. I didn't say his channel should be taken down for the video. I just responded by saying I want nothing more to do with you. The debate we were supposed to have is off. Um, you know, piss off and have a good life. Uh, and he couldn't accept that. And then everything else happened. And yeah, he is somewhat of a sore subject for me. So I'm sorry if you got in the crossfire. All right, that's fine. Um, uh, why were you so so reluctant to debate me initially? Like, was it because you thought that I was fine with him doing what what he did? Um, if I if I remember correctly, it was it was that reason. Yeah. Um. Because again, um, you know, uh, I've, I, 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 that that had to be the only reason. In fact, I'm about ninety five percent sure that was the only reason. Because I've had my ass whipped in debates before, so or talks like this before, so. That, but again, that wasn't whatever, whatever gave you the idea that I was fine with it? I, you came on the stream with him. That again, to me, that was enough. Uh, again, so guilt by um, association, then. Okay, basically, yes. Um, <laughs> and again, is that right? Maybe not, but I don't have time to. Again, I'm doing a live stream. I'm trying to play a video game. I'm trying to be entertaining. And and I will say this. You guys kept pestering me. You well, guys I, did not I'll let do... up. For a, if you remember, for about the first 30 minutes, I, did, I wasn't responding to you. I wasn't getting... And then finally, yeah, eventually with enough needling... And people can go watch this. Yeah, you eventually irritated me a little. So, yeah, sorry if you were... And I believe you typed in about 15 times, you want more debate on YouTube, but you won't debate me. Yeah, because it's an inconsistency. It's like, I, it's like, I, I want more debate, but I'm not... Association. Gonna... I'm sorry, what's You that? were friends with him. And anyone that was friends with him, at, in, at least in my mind, was blacklisted. I wasn't going to block you. Isn't that kind of petty, though? You, again, you can you can argue pettiness all you like. Um, I, and maybe it is. Maybe you're right on that. Maybe that was kind of petty of me. But, again, he he's the one YouTuber that has, I'd say, taken it to an extreme um i will have to call for a restroom break here um uh so if you want to respond to people in the chat for a moment i really have to pee all right that's fine shout out to alan my home dog my main nigga what are you guys up to do, 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 do. jesus this is <laughs> This is a cesspool of stupidity. Uh, <laughs> not quite sure what to say. I'm just kind of browsing through an endless ocean of stupid bullshit. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, like, if he took offense to that, that's his prerogative. I just don't see how it's pertinent to any of uh, Mick's arguments. Do, 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 do. The Swedish child is... To I'm a child, yes. I'm a 20-year-old child. Gaga goo goo and all that. <laughs> all he does is make videos on bully. Yeah, how dare I have a hobby that I enjoy that partially pays my bills and keeps me afloat. Okie dokie. All right, welcome back. We are back. Your chat really is something. I'll say that much. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm I'm the one hosting this live stream, so I actually can't watch the uh, chat. 
Oh, you can you can probably see that just by going to your channel and just looking through it there. I did that once, and um, believe it or not, the it started to do that reverb effect. Oh. Have you ever done like a Skype call with like the the, the webcams, and you don't yeah. have headphones on? You'll get this ungodly reverb effect. But can you just like mute the tab? I believe Chrome has a feature for that. Uh, I hate to bring this up. I'm about as um, I'm about as inept at, at hangouts as you. <laughs> I'm, I believe it or not, I'm not as much time as I spend online with podcasts and YouTube. I'm not. I'm actually not the most tech savvy guy in the world. Believe it or not. Sure. Um, I feel it's about time we wrap this up in just like five to ten minutes. Um, okay. I just want to clarify, like, I don't have any hard feelings against you. I just, like, disagree on some things. Uh, I enjoy your content. I've been watching you for quite a while. I don't, I rarely ever comment on your videos, though, but I do watch quite a few of them. Uh, I find them to be kind of just, like, good, um, I don't know, not background noise, but, they're, you know, they're interesting to listen to while, like, I play GTA and shit. Actually, uh, that's why uh, I've thought about maybe I'd be a little bit, little bit better at podcasting where I just ramble on for an hour about shit. Uh, but I, I thank you for for watching me, and uh, I, I actually I got to start watching your shit. I did view a little bit of it. I, I did actually, believe it or not, I did watch a little bit of the uh, video you made to me. I ran out of time um, with all the other shit. Um, but um, yeah, um, I don't have any hard feelings with you. Again, like I said, might have been a little bit of guilt by association um and again you know i'll freely admit that might be a little petty on my part but it's a little bit of the way i am you know uh but i don't have any hard feelings against you again if you want to have the the gun control thing i'll be more than happy to do that um at a uh, a future date um so if you if you'd like to do that but no i don't i don't have any hard feelings with you but as for the autistic atheist, um, I, I, he's your friend, that's fine. But if he would just piss off forever, that would be great. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just like naturally attracted to like edge lords, you know? I don't know what it is, but it just captivates my interest. You know, believe it or not, I don't even know what the fucking edge lord is. Uh, it's 4chan personified. <laughs> oh, no, I, I don't even know what 4chan. I've never been on 4chan. <laughs> like yeah. I said, I am I am not the most tech savvy guy in the world. <laughs> you know, I mean, I, I outside of my computer and my PS4, I don't know how to stream games. Believe it or not. All right, fair enough. Uh, did you did you almost say that you don't know what 4chan is? I I actually don't. I've never been on the site. You're probably better off not knowing in all honesty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've, I've, I've I, obviously I've heard of it, but I've never actually bothered to go to 4chan. Same thing as Reddit. I don't know how the fuck that works. All I see is a bunch of text shit that's... I don't know how people navigate that motherfucker. I, hey. So, yeah, I'm, I, I'm completely ignorant of 4chan and, and Reddit. And, uh, again, if it's not... Um, YouTube, Hulu, Netflix, Pornhub, X Hamster, and some other porn sites. I'm not interested. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Whatever floats your boat. Uh, I've, I've got one final question before I leave. Um, and that is, how in the fuck can you like Budweiser? Like, I'm not much of a beer critic myself, but that is, like, by far the most subpar thing I've ever tasted. <laughs> you know, um... Believe it or not, this is the thing that that I've had to eat the most shit over. Um, and my best and my my only answer is, I like it. Um, maybe it's because I'm not the biggest. I I don't mind some craft beers, but I'm not the biggest craft beer fan. Um, maybe it's because I'm a natural chugger. I mean, I chug everything: water, beer, coffee. Um, you name it. If it's liquid, I chug it. I, I, I don't sip. Um, 
I, I don't know. I just like Budweiser. I, I know I've had to eat a lot of shit over it, and, that, and that's fine. Um, you know, uh, like I said, I just I like Budweiser. <laughs> I like Coors, too, but yeah, I don't know. Just Budweiser I don't know. Guys. I'm more of a cold spurting dude myself, but whatever floats your boat. Um, yeah. Um, as far as far as the whole chugging thing goes, you actually made it made that clear in one of your response videos. You you told me and Mick, uh, I can drink both of you under the table. Maybe I'll take that take you up on that offer someday. <laughs> Good luck. Yeah, I don't know. I I I'm, I'm, I much prefer the uh, Mary Jane than uh, alcohol. Less Believe it or not, um, actually speaking of the Mary Jane, I actually don't like it. I can't really? stand it. Yeah, no, it gets me paranoid. It gets me, I hate it. I feel like I'm drunk, but I don't have the wonderful liquid in my belly. <laughs> I, 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 the times maybe, I've had it, the times I've had it, I, I've hated it. I, I can't stand it. I hate, I hate, don't mind drunk, hate high. You know, I've, I've been around paranoid high people and like being around those people pisses me off more than how sorry I feel for them. So... <laughs> Yeah. yeah, it's 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 just I'm it's just I'm 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 that twitchy. I I'm like a mercat in Africa. I'm twitchy. My head's going fifty miles an hour. Not mellow. Don't have the munchies. You know, don't want to sit and listen to a Bob Marley seed. It's like yeah, that's me on booze. Really? Mellow. Just want to kick back, play some games, and have a good time. For me, it's like the opposite. Whenever, whenever I get drunk, I feel like listening to like System of a Down or something. <laughs> yeah. Um, well, everybody's got their choice in music. Um, me, I'm a well. I, I like metal when I'm drunk, but uh, typically I'm a. I, I either watch movies or YouTube or play video games, or occasionally I'll live broadcast some stuff. Then I'll delete later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, we all have our hobbies. Anyway, uh, I gotta take off. It's been fun talking to you. Um, if you want to do the whole gun debate thing, we'll get something set up. Alrighty, uh, feel free to email me. Um, I got a debate uh, this Tuesday lineup with Wooly Bumblebee. She was none too happy with my um, "If men stop working, the world stops" comment or uh, video. Um, so, but yeah, maybe, uh, next, the Tuesday after that, or, um, I don't know, maybe next weekend in two weeks. All right. Rock on. All righty. Um, so yeah, this, uh, this about wraps it up. This was, uh, Swagta versus Warcraft 666. No mercy. Um, so, um, this is Warcraft wishing everyone, uh, a pleasant evening. Swagta, you want the closing comment? Um, yeah, sure. Shout out to uh, Mick and Alan in the chat. And uh, Owen, I noticed that Owen uh, actually commented on my video and was like, I'm excited for this debate, so I hope you enjoyed, buddy. <laughs> well, Owen seems to like uh, anybody that uh, is not uh, has, a, has a bone to pick with me because I've beaten him twice. Yeah, well, you know, the enemy of, the enemy of my enemy is my friend or whatever. <laughs> I don't know. I actually with Owen, it's it's just more um at least my opinion. Jesus Christ, my opinion. It's I think when he gets into the real world, it's he's gonna 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 be learning a cruel lesson. So um anyway, uh that wraps up this one. Thanks for joining us, everybody. Um have a pleasant evening. <laughs>